Once again, everyone, welcome back to AIW's Intense TV. I am your host on this week's episode, the moderator of sorts, Steve Guy. On this week, we are taking a look back to February 29th, 2024. AIW's Leap took place from the Mercury Music Lounge in Lakewood, Ohio. If you can't catch it yet, you will be able to soon on Triller TV Plus, so keep an eye out for that. It was an action-packed show. One of the highlights of the show, of course, was a classic multi-man battle where four AIW stars went to war. We had the clashing styles of the unbreakable Tyler Jordan, Marino Tanaglia, Sam Hardway Holloway, and the blue collar brawler Kaplan himself, all entangled in an all out fist to fist, Larry to Larry, just, you gotta go back and watch it. On top of that, we had the affiliate, as he's known as Chuck Stone, taking on Alex Melee, doing the bidding of Chuck's friend, Eric Taylor, because apparently Alex Melee is an internet troll, according to Eric Taylor. Finally, on the same show, we had this long-standing rivalry between Vic Vice and Austin James put to rest. All right, boys, all right, boys. Enough about burying people, let's get to rolling. What are we playing? Who wants to start it? I'll start, I'll start. I got the quickest hands here. All right, let's I'll see. I'll roll, but you, before we roll, I, can we just take a moment I'm a little upset that we are back here. My cousin Terrence died in that room. Who? Who is this? My cousin. Your cousin? Yeah. Terrence isn't real. What? what are you talking about? This and then they show. used the coffin for some swamp monster and some hillbilly. Hey, hey. Stop. All Let's right. play. Just Let's roll. Play. Just roll. Get back to the game. I'll, we'll play. We'll play. Yahtzee! Yahtzee? We're playing crabs. No, we, we are ro We're shooting sevens. What are you talking we're about? We're shooting! Right? We're not... Put the gun away. Put the... We're not shooting no guns. We're just playing some dice. Calm down, hard way. If you want to shoot, go do that somewhere else. You know, I will. Stop looking at me funny. You know what I can't stand right now? Jeff from corporate got me wrestling Dr. Dan. Is he even a real doctor? He's supposed to be my follow-up? There's only one doctor I trust. Dr. Phil! You know, I'm, I I can't even look at you. All right. Yeah. Look, I don't know what that cowboy's mad about. At least he gets to wrestle new people. I mean, this is like what? The sixth show where I gotta put Austin in this place. He's been riding my coattails ever since the Fonzie and Gauntlet. I mean, I'm sick of him. I should be wrestling people like Shelby or like Derek or I should be wrestling you! Alright. We can table that, you know. I'm. I'm well. Jeff from corporate put me in another four way. Clearly, he's not watching the product. I mean, I was just in a four way with people like Josh Bishop, Alec Price, and Paul London. Now I'm in there with a rookie, a tag guy that took the Abso strap from me like a year ago. And Kaplan. I've been in the ring with Kaplan. I don't like being in the ring with Kaplan. I should probably go get ready. Here we are in my environment at the Mercury Lounge. Bar environment, this is my fucking type of place. I got so many fucking options. I got bottles, I got chairs, I got tables, I got people I can fucking throw at anybody. Maybe that little bitch Tyler Jordan. Man, when I'm done with that kid, he's gonna be fucking breaking down the ring and being a good little bitch and doing his little thing. I got the big tall motherfucker, and I got that other motherfucker, I don't even know his name. All I know is I'm gonna do some fucking damage. And if you're not here tonight, you're missing a fucking great show, but you can catch it next week on Fight Plus. Leap, February 29th. Tyler Jordan, Marino, Kaplan, and Big Sam Holloway go to war in a fatal four-way. But there's only going to be one guy standing at the end of the night, and his name is Tyler Jordan. Because I'm going to show everyone in Lakewood, Ohio, why I'm simply untouchable. And if you can't be here live tonight, you're missing out. But you can catch it on Chiller TV+. Plus. Here we are again, AIW, and today it's just me, Marino T, coming all the way from Erotic City. 
Philly C, he's got some other business to take care of, and we're about business lately. And you know what? I got three other men in this match. Honestly, they got a lot going for them. We got Kaplan. I mean, Kaplan, former Fonzie champion. I mean, we love Fonzie to death. I hope, Fonzie, I know you're watching. I hope you're doing great, pal. I miss you. But Cap, you got to watch out for that clothesline. I know that already. Then we got Sam Hardway Holloway. Man, I know one thing. I know he's probably real pissed off tonight because I know they spelled his name wrong on that match card. So I better watch out. He might be flying through the air. He might be choke slamming me on my back. But not only that, we got Tyler Jordan. Tyler Jordan, I've been seeing everything you've done with Josh Prohibition. Philly and I, we're not, we're not too shy when it comes to Josh Prohibition. We understand what he's capable of and we've seen what you've done against him. So I got three competitors tonight. But don't forget, this is Marino T, the smooth operator, one half of PME. The good times and good vibes are alive tonight. But this is my dance floor, and this is my fight. <laughs> Show day, baby. Vic Vice, buddy. It's me, your old friend, Austin James. I know you know me because I know you pretty well. We've uh, done this a couple times, but this is it. Tonight's the night. We finish it. We squash it. And speaking of squashing, I, I'm squashing you tonight, buddy. All over that canvas. You're no longer the artist. I am. I hope you're ready, buddy. Because <laughs> I sure am. The main event of Leap saw Eric Taylor defending his intense title in a rematch against the man he wanted against, Maserati Wes Barkley. Wes wants to figure out how bright that future is of Eric Taylor, so go back and watch it, especially because this was personal to Wes Barkley as Eric Taylor cashed in and took out Wes Barkley with the help of his cronies, Cash is King, at AIW's Tear at the Temple back in December. This has been a special show in Wadsworth. We've got a special main event, Terror at the Temple, five on five. No count out, no disqualification, falls, count anywhere. It is truly gonna be Terror in the Temple, Nathan. Duke and Money Shot were instrumental in hitting the JT Lightning Invitational Tournament trophy that sits next to you into the hands of Eric Taylor. Chuck Stone, Chuck Stone, Death Valley Driver through the door in the general admission bleachers. And there's one thing about that Eric Taylor. Yeah, he's stopping a mud hole in West Barkley. I say that son of a bitch has a bright future if you don't say so myself. Broner with Nystrom into the rail. It's complete chaos. Eric has gotten positioned. He's fighting at Marino and falling down out. Both men down, just collapsing onto all the bodies on the floor. But Holloway, oh my God! Stone off the ring apron through two tables. What Hardway is that? Holloway's been handcuffed at ringside to that guardrail. Hardway Holloway has been locked up. Philly Collins in the corner right here, the left upper corner of your screen's been locked it looks up. Looks like he's got he's got Marino on the other side now. But Barkley. Barkley just laid on Eric Taylor what? about the pin! Fonzie is out there, but there is nothing he can do against these five. But Barkley's gonna, gonna fight. fight his way out! And Cash's King is absolutely taking apart the intense champion, Maserati Wes Barkley. And now, money shot now! Money shot spike pile driver on Fonzie! Eric Taylor is officially cashing in the 2023 JT Lightning Invitational Tournament trophy to compete for the intense title. Wes Barkley's out on his feet right Philly now. Collins is trying to warn Wes. 
Elijah Dean, though, hits him. There's the kick from Taylor, cover two, three. Again, man, you guys just really love doing all this pre-match promo bullshit, huh? Listen, I've already said everything that I need to say, okay? I no longer am worried about Mr. West Barkley. You wanna know why? Because I already have this. And when I have this, I am at my best. So, the biggest thing that I can say is just make sure that you watch the replay of it on Triller TV, because the fact of the matter is, is I'm gonna beat Wes once again I'm gonna keep this title and I'm gonna go into Cleveland and defend it just like I do every single time. I'm gonna entertain, I'm gonna deliver, I'm gonna be the main event just like I am every single time I'm in that ring because my future is too bright. Yes sir, Maserati West West Barkley back at you once again. Tonight's the night. If you thought you could miss a show, well what are you doing? Because when I'm on the show, you know some shit's about to go down. Am I allowed to swear on here? Who cares? Tonight, I passed Johnny Gargano. Number two in the all-time most main events in AIW history. Eric Taylor, you're not on my level. No matter how you want to cut it, how you want to slice it, how many times you've been in the ring with me, you're not on my level. The last two times we were in the ring, I pinned you. I mean, we can talk about when you had five of your goons, beat me up, bust me open. And then you got the pin? What kind of man does that make you? Everything I've done, I did it on my lonesome. Clawed, scratched, all the way up to the top. And right when I had that belt, right when I was going on my run, your little punk ass had to come in there and interfere. Duke, I already smoked you. Money Shot, I already smoked you. Chuck Stone, the affiliate, I already smoked you. Eric Taylor, I don't know how many times I slapped your ass silly, but tonight is a can't miss show because live at the Mercury Lounge, my backyard, you're about to see a new champ. Two-time Maserati West Barkley. Two-time intense champ. The encore. Only right we did it in Lakewood. Eric Taylor, I hope you enjoyed your time with that belt because it's coming to an end. It's coming to an end real soon. And I can't wait to be celebrating with that baby blue tonight in Lakewood. And for everybody watching at home, Intense TV, whatever you're doing, just know this. The new champ's here. And anybody that wants it can get it. Eric Taylor, I'm leaving with that belt. And you can bet on that. So one of the things that AIW has always prided itself on is the strength of the tag team division. AIW's Leap saw two newer tag teams take each other on in competition. The brand new debuting tag team of BAX, Sid Von England, teaming up with Zay Garcia as they went up against another newer tag team in Dominic Greeny and Shaw Mason. Dominic Greeny and Shaw Mason, no strangers though, they always accompany each other to the ring as of late, and Dominic has been a role model and trainer for Shaw Mason. However, let's take a look back at one of the times they did actually team up in AIW's biggest party of the summer, Wrestle Rager 7. Yeah, I finally figured out, seeing him in the shades, I finally figured out why I hate Tyson Riggs so much. Because I know I've said he's got a real punchable finally face. Finally figured it out. I, he's got a real punchable face, and that's still the same. But seeing him with the shades on and that, that smile on his face, he's Iceman. <laughs> I'm just waiting for him to do like a real obnoxious chomp together of his teeth at somebody. Here we go. He is ready for some beach volleyball. Cisco Silver. So, you know, you folks at home haven't seen it yet. Especially if you're not on our Patreon, you definitely haven't seen it. But these two teamed up for the first time at North Canton. Nope. Here comes Cisco Silver. Shut the hell up! What's worse, 
Warriors. The fact that you all look like rats, or the fact that I smell marijuana in this fucking place. Cisco Silver, off duty, still looking, still looking to make some arrests. He's got a, a duty to you the know law. What? Everybody against the law and spread your fucking cheeks. Usually that's spread your fucking cheeks. Pussies on the pavement, boys. Tyson Riggs seems real excited about all of that. And their opponents. Debut at Absolution. Dumb. Still finding themselves. Stop, stop tapping the mic. I probably shouldn't do the whole dad thing, but who here likes what Cisco Silver's putting out today? No! Shaw, what do you think about Cisco Silver and the, the karate cop over there? You guys are some cops? I don't believe it. Let me see some badge numbers right now. Hey, can I just hear a like, fuck you pigs chant? They're all real so, drunk. They can't even get in and see These guys are probably yeah, like rules, but this is fucking Wrestle Rager. So we're not going to have a regular tag match. Let's go tornado style rules. Is that a crazy rip for Charles Man? Dumb. Charles Mann doesn't have to approve it. It's Russell Rager. Russell Rager. Whatever Steve guys dressed that today. As we know, nobody has to approve anything around here. <laughs> oh, ring, ring the, the bell. bell. Oh, God. We got to approve that. That can't happen real fast. Wasn't ready. Cisco Silver and Tyson Riggs, as we were saying. They teamed up for the first time at North Canton. Oof. Main Street Festival. And now they're meeting a team that won their initial appearance. Had absolution over wrestling. Double Both suplex. That stereo vertical suplexes. Let's go. Shaw Mason, Dominic Greeny in control. Now, now a double suplex. Double suplex. Uh, Tyson Riggs. Of course, all the competitors in this matchup know. for the strange. double clothesline. And Tyson Riggs go right to the outside. The competitors in the matchup, no strangers to each other. This Dom beat is taken right now. Tope Suicida wipes out both of his opponents. I was just about to say, he beat Tyson Riggs in his debut matchup at Fresh Meat last year, last August. What, what are they doing here? A little bit of it's tandem a, teamwork. Beat. Off of the shoulders of Dominic Garini as he stands on the ring apron down to the outside, wiping out Cisco Silver and Tyson Riggs. Shaw Mason, Dominic Garini. Just getting about to say that Dom also beat Cisco Silver at Cibernetico de Mayo 2 back in May. Oh no. That's assaulting oh. an officer, sir. Now we're, we're going back to North Canton, oh, Jesus apparently. Christ. Oh! oh. These aren't little oh, no. kids, though, like it was in North Canton. grown adults. They're very drunken, grown adults. I think one of them just twisted his nose. And now he's got that. I think it's just a piece of wood. He's busted across Garini's back. Meanwhile, Riggs driving the point of the elbow. 
Down into Shaw Mason. Shaw Mason in the ring. Cisco Silver and Tyson Riggs full control right now. Cisco Silver kicks the leg while Riggs. Is driving a paddle of sorts. Now Riggs makes the cover. Or the cocky cover is only good for a one, one count. count. I didn't think it was going to be any more than that, Charles. You don't got to tell me. Shaw Mason debuting alongside Tyson Riggs, coming from that last class to the AIW Academy. Oh, Riggs with those nunchucks. Actually has a win over Shaw Mason at Rumble on Main Street last year. And Shaw Mason had a series of matches with Cisco Silver last year. I'm the Carini. Carini's got those. Oh! Well, he's trying to put on a demonstration. He just hit Cisco Silver in the head with it. I'm the Carini. Jiu Jitsu, they do not use nunchucks, no, apparently. Not a, not, a, not a lot of nunchucks. Not a lot of nunchucking. Nunchuckery, I think is how it is. It's the official, official martial arts term. Cisco Silver up, up and, and over. over. Kick to the gut. midsection, kick, kick below the belt, it looked like. Northern oh. Light suplex floating over. Moonsault makes Cisco the cover. Silver. Hook of the leg to Shaw Mason there to break it up. Cisco Silver getting a little out, a little crazy there. Oh, point of the toe right to the chin. Just kicking Shaw Mason in the head. Now, <laughs> slapping him. Riggs has that board. Stomping down now on Dominic Greeny's midsection. You can see the welt on the back of Tyson Riggs from oh, Dominic Greeny hitting with that. I guess I don't know what it was, like some type of paddle of sorts. Now they both got a hold of those. Nunchuck. Looking for a double clothesline assisted. Instead they eat clotheslines. Oh, back elbows. Clotheslines again for each man. And now double overhead release, belly to belly suplexes. Well timed. Coming back the other way now. Riggs and Cisco Silver just getting thrown around by Garini and Mason. Now stereo German suplexes, both of them bridge too. Only a two count. Both of them out on two. Now what is he? Oh, great call for a table, I think. I think that's what he said. You know, oh, getting doors. Some doors. Listen, they, they had enough of the table. Yeah, that's a <laughs> last go of it. I don't know. I think they probably would like that to happen to their opponents. Last go, but it fouled down. That, that one's got blinds on it. They're setting those doors up in the corners now. Like I said, $15 for a real table. If you can find a table for 15 hey. bucks, we'd love to know where you're getting it from. Yeah, he hasn't priced tables lately. <laughs> Both men kicked below the belt. Setting him up. Shotgun oh. drop kick on one side, spear on the other. One, Hook two. of the leg, Cisco Silver. Two Ooh, count only. Two count. I'm green kicking out last, last nanosecond there. Shaw Mason hasn't moved. He's still stuck beneath that piece of the door. Oh, kick to the head. Riggs caught his own partner. Oh. Clothesline by Greeny. Clothesline the soul out of Tyson Riggs. He's telling Shaw Mason to go up. Shaw Mason barely moving, barely getting to his feet. Greeny. Greeny's got him up. Got Shaw Cisco Mason. Silver up. Cross body, oh. doomsday style two, but Only there is two Riggs count. break it up. Riggs, hook kick to Dominic Greeny. Riggs pulls Shaw Mason up. Shaw Mason drop step, go behind, runs him in. 
Looking for the chaos theory. Oh, elbow to the face. Oh, kick right to the midsection to follow it up. Gut wrench and just Shaw Mason flipping over the top, looking to pick the ankle. Riggs rolls Ooh, through, through and rolls him up too. Two count, almost a three count. That would have been a huge win. Open hand shot from Riggs. Power bomb by Tyson Riggs. He's got Shaw Mason stacked up, but he's out on two. Another two count. Tyson Riggs looking impressive right now. Riggs sizing up, looking for the kick. It's caught by Shaw Mason, who turns it over ankle right lock. into the ankle lock. Crowd really looking for that, looking for Tyson Riggs to tap here. Tyson Riggs holding on. Muscles his way back up to his feet. Of course, this Shaw Mason to break it. Rear waist lock. Oh, clothesline assisted German suplex, two count only. Taken out. Cisco getting into the ring. He's got that chair. But Shaw Mason just diving in, cuts him off before he can use it. Dominic Garini across the head. Dominic Garini. Cop killer! Garini with the cop killer, hook of the leg, two and three. Dominic Garini. Dominic Garini and Shaw Mason. Fitting cop killer to end the match, Wadsworth. And he's claimed the nunchuck. <laughs> oh. Couple Steve Wazers. Oh, that was impressive by Dom. Knocked it out of his hand, full rotation, and he caught it. Dom McGreeny, not much of a drinker, but he just chugged that. Paul Mason also not much of a drinker. Looking like real professionals drinking the I don't know, there's a lot of beer left in that as he's oh, oh, got okay, man. <laughs> Just trying to give him a little bit of props. I right, listen, he gets all the props for the way he caught that thing. Shaw Mason was so excited to cheers him, knocked it out of his hand, did a full rotation, and Dom somehow caught it upright again. Tom McGreedy, stop swinging those nut jocks. You're gonna hurt. Oh, he's gonna, oh, gonna, gonna, gonna choke Shaw Mason out. Oh. Oh, posing for pictures for Battis. So that's going to do it for this week's episode of AIW Intense TV. Make sure you follow us on all sorts of social media, pretty much any social media available. Whether you like us on Facebook, you go to YouTube, you follow us on X, we're on the TikTok now. It's all at AI Wrestling. And of course, go back and watch AIW's Leap on Triller TV+. And if you want even more exclusive access, to stars and management of AIW, go to patreon.com slash AI wrestling and become a member of our Patreon. If you want to wear hoodies, hats, t-shirts, any sort of gear to showcase your love for AIW, go to AIWmerch.com. And as always, for an exclusive behind the scenes look into the stories and how our shows took place, follow us on social media and check into our weekly podcast, The Card Is Going To Change. Finally, go to AIWrestling.com always for tickets and other things to purchase and the news that you don't catch on social media. But the most important thing, buy tickets to our upcoming show March 22nd, AIW's Tougher Than Leather. We've got the returns of Effie and Dan Housen, including special meet and greets with them and Demolition. Plus, you are hearing it here first, the AIW debut of international sensation, Microman. That's it. Until next time, take care, everybody.